good morning students in the third class the second we are going to discuss about the second class animals and human beings in this lesson we are discussed about the characteristic features of the animals and characteristic features of human beings now we are going to discuss about the human beings unique features unique features means the the different one in the animals and the human beings there are the same main difference is the in the human beings we, then their brain was very developed so most animals have the brain but it is not much developed that's why when the human beings uh, brain was developed that's why uh, we develop the that's why we can think we can which help which helps them to create something new we can build new houses we can uh, speak many languages we can invent many many things that likes we can invent so many new items new new items like scientists so scientists nowadays they can uh, prepare they can made so new many new items so in uh, that means in the human brain in the human being the brain was very developed but compared to the animals that's why we can speak so many languages we can do so many works in our daily life uh, now we have to see about the differences between the animals and the human beings the main difference between the first difference between the animals and the human beings is movement in the animals move from one place to another place using with their legs but human beings walk there without uh, with legs in the upright positions uh, four legs animals have the four legs and birds fly using wings and fish swim using fins animals have moved from one place to another place using with their legs they uh, all animals have the four legs in the insects have the six legs and birds fly mo moving from one place to another place using wings and fish also swim with their fins but human beings we are move from one place to another place using with our legs in upright position the hands and legs are separated in uh, we are using independently freely we are using independently hands and the legs so second difference between the animals and human beings is the communication animals make uh, different different sounds to communicate each other uh, like dogs are barks uh, box and uh, cows are uh make uh, making the different different every animal make different different sounds to communicate each other but human beings we are using so many languages to uh, uh, to communicate each other to communicate each other with our speech the third difference between us reproduction some animals reproduced laying eggs and some animals giving birth to young ones most probably in the birds they uh, reproduce laying eggs like hens birds like that but more some of animals they can give birth to young ones like dog cows like that so human beings also we give birth only one way that is we give the birth to younger ones the next fourth one differ both difference is the shelter some animals live in their natural environment already we discussed about that lions rabbit rats they live in the natural environment and some animals make their homes like rat rat make their home rat rat make uh, uh, a big hole and live there so that means all animals live there in uh, natural environment some animals make their home but human beings live in home using different type of materials for preparing a house we are using bricks cement iron uh, uh, like this stones and uh, like this okay next difference between next difference is the food some of the animals eat only the plants some of the animals eat flesh and some of animals eat both flesh and plants you in the human beings also we mostly eat different type of foods in our daily life we eat both plants and the flesh of animals so next other fact other difference is, is the animals care and the animals we are the, there are the warm blooded animals or cold blooded animals but in the human beings we are the warm blooded animals only 
uh, animals provide their young ones with food warm and protection for the certain period period of time they give the provide the food and warmth and protection human beings we have to take care of our children uh, lifelong we take that take care of our children and also we take much time than animals to we have the so much of time of life span life span means the living time we have the so much time of the living time so this is the difference between the animals and the human beings first is the movement second is the communication third one is the reproduction fourth one is the shelter fifth one is the food next one is the our body temperature compared to the surroundings